Hey guys, it's Shay Zane, and today I thought might be a good day to vlog. Um, I'm actually going to work um, from 11 to 3 today though, so it's a short shift. It's about four hours. Um, but usually it's Tuesday, and usually on Tuesday I work 11 to 8.30. But um, TJ had asked me if I can try to get my second shift off, which would be, the, uh, which would be 4 to 8.30 off. Um, but I was like, you know, it's kind of last minute. I don't think anybody's going to do it. Sorry, just picking up some scraps off the floor for mine current. Um, so I was like, no, it's last minute. So, you know, nobody's probably going to want to do anything. And, um, one of the girls that I work with, she asks me from time to time to work for, um, if she can work for me, if she wants some extra money or whatever. And most of the time, you know, I say go for it, but... Um, I was a little bit nervous because I missed a week and a half from when I went to Puerto Rico. But TJ was like, please get it off. You know, we never really get to spend time with each other anymore, which is true. And I was like, all right. There's a new lamp in my living room. <laughs> I don't know where that lamp came from. That was really bizarre. Someone's coming into my house and redecorating. <laughs> um... Oh no, I'm excited. So he's like, you know what? He's like, because we have, you know, this day off together. Let's go do something fun. He's like, let's not just like stay home. I know you love Boston. Let's go take a trip to the city. It's like 30 minutes away. Not a long trip at all. Um, let's go take a trip into the city. And I'm like, all right, well, that's fine. But oh my gosh, I need to sweep this floor. <laughs> um, but my mom wants to get my baby shower photo taken for the invitations. She wants to get like a cute uh, photo of me and TJ to put on the invitation. So I said, all right, that's fine. I'll be home at work from three, at three. Probably, well, I'll probably get home around like 3.20. It's about a 20 minute drive home. And then uh, I'm gonna put you down for a second, hey. Okay, so it's about a 20 minute ride home. So I'm like, all right, I'll probably be home around 3.30. Um, you know, I'll get ready. I just really gotta do my hair, just take it out and like re-straighten it or whatever. I already picked out what I'm going to wear for clothes so that won't take any time. It's getting real dark. And uh, and then we'll head over to my mom's and take a quick photo and then we'll go into Boston. So, stairs are like my worst enemy now. <laughs> um, so, yeah, so that's exciting. I'm really excited because I haven't been in quite a while. And it's like... It's a cooler day. Sorry, I'm still cleaning. It's a cooler day. It's probably like 60. I definitely need a jacket, but it's a, a nice day to, you know, go walk around and go get something to eat or whatever we're going to do. Oh, goodness. But I told TJ, I'm like, well, while I'm gone, while I'm at work, I need you to bring my cat Felix to the vet because he's been... um. It's weird. Before I left for Puerto Rico, he was kind of limping. Like, you could definitely tell he was limping. And we figured, you know, maybe he got bit by a tick. Like, check his paw, see if he stepped in glass or whatever. We checked checked his paw. Nothing was wrong. Um, so we're going to go take him to the vet. His limping has, like... Like, I'll watch him walk every day to see what's going on. And he has, like... What on earth... Sorry. He has like a very minor limp. Like it's, you really have to pay attention to notice it. If you didn't know he had it, you'd be like, oh, like he's just walking normally, you know? Um, but I just want to take him to the vet and make sure that everything is okay. You know, I don't want to, if he's in pain, I don't want him to be in pain, but he seems okay. Like he doesn't not use that paw. He walks on it. I don't know. Everything looks fine, but... <laughs> He's a, he's a male cat, <laughs> and this is the cat carrier <laughs> I have, and TJ has to bring him because I'll be at work and we won't have time not to work, so I'm like, I am extremely sorry for the really feminine <laughs> cat case, and I have his uh, papers too, just in case. I'm like, I'm sorry for the really feminine cat case, but that's the only one I have because the one that he came in, which was just like a big um, gray plastic case. That one my mom has, uh, cause she had to use it for her cat, so. Sorry. <laughs> Here's my baby girl, though. Yep, the boys are outside. Hey, mama. 
Can you meow? Her meow is so stinking cute. Meow, Mama. Ivy. Ivy. She's not going to meow. Of course she's not. By the way, these bins are all summer clothes and clothes I don't fit in. Um, so i got to find a place for that once my bedroom is redone and everything. But I'm just kind of starting to try to get things together uh, before I head out to work. i got to leave in probably like 10 minutes, something like that. But I don't know. I just wanted to talk to you guys. I like to. I love vlogging with you guys. But the thing is, <laughs> my life is literally just so unentertaining. Um, it's gotten a lot crazier because now I'm pl planning the wedding. Um, I have the baby shower. All that fun stuff to show you guys. But on a day-to-day -day basis, um, <laughs> it's not really entertaining. And then a lot of the times when I go like out to places like an example is Thursday today's Tuesday so Thursday I'm going with my maid of honor to go try on the bridesmaid's dress and then not this Friday but the following Friday I'm taking a couple of the other girls to go try it on but none of them are like comfortable being on camera and I don't want to just pull out the camera and start filming them especially if they're uncomfortable with that type of stuff so a lot of the times when I do have something to do like, I'll run a lot of errands with my mom, but I just don't want to make anybody feel uncomfortable. So, when I'm finally alone again, nothing entertaining is happening. I'm going to put you down for a second so I can put on my sneakers. But, um, like I said, once I'm alone again, nothing entertaining has happened. Whatever happened already happened. <laughs> and then I'm back home just doing nothing. So, um, the only person that I really turn the camera on with is uh, TJ because he knows I do YouTubing and uh, he's a goofball on camera so I don't think he minds it much so um like I said TJ doesn't mind being on camera which is very nice so I will probably whip out the camera at uh, some point during the Boston trip not the entire Boston trip but ah, I like I don't know if you can see that like slice my finger in two places and it like hurts there's no blood it like just got like the skin but oh it like stings if you touch it. Sucks. <laughs> I don't know if anybody else has this, but this like weird obsession over documentaries on Netflix is really random. <laughs> really random. Let me put on the gloss real quick. Hold on one second. It's my mirror mirror. My lips are like so dry. I like this. Because it's a very subtle color, as you can see, and it's not like overly like. Ooh, it's actually, I'll show you. Uh, it's Tinted Lip Balm by C.O. Bigelow, number 1427. It doesn't have like a name on it, but it just looks like that. And it's totally, it's like destroyed. <laughs> it's the, the packaging, I made it ugly, but my mom had given that to me a while ago, but. Anyways, um, oh, really quick update on the whole computer situation. I updated my RAM. I updated, I took out the RAM card for my old computer. It's not old. It was actually fairly new, but it didn't work very well anymore. So I took out that RAM and I put it into my new computer. So I went from two gigabytes to six. Um, but I still need to get a graphics card. I opened up the tower and everything and I took a look at what we had inside and there's an opening for a graphic card. So, um... Okay, sorry, I was cut off real quick, but basically I was just saying that I'm just going to buy a graphics card, and then I was going to go look um, for one of those like lighting umbrellas that people can use for um, videos, so I don't have to really worry about lighting anymore. Hopefully that'll fix my problem. But anyways, I, I had to go through my phone and delete some videos, so I had more um, space to, uh, to um, record today, but I kind of ran out of time while doing that, so I really got to go to work, but I will see you in two seconds. Hello! <laughs> we are in Boston now. Hi. <laughs> what are you staring at? We just went, we're in the North End right now. We the North just End. Ate. Where did we just eat? Uh, Restaurant de Fiore. It was an Italian place. It was pretty good. Don't like rape the cop car. It's a random cop car like in the middle of the sidewalk. People in oh. Boston don't have fucking hey, courtesy hey, to walk. Hey, 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 hey. Gonna get shamed. What? I don't know. Where we go? I think we're going to. Thank you. Well, we're eventually going to go to Faneuil Hall. I don't know about right now. We're just walking. 
We're just walking. You see my, my man tit? My, my man side boob? That's a nice side <laughs> boob, isn't it? <laughs> okay, uh, I will bring you guys back when something interesting happens. Okay, so we're in Faneuil Hall right now. That's right. And <laughs> we're just sitting. I got a ice cream and it has pink jimmies. I've never seen that before. And he's texting, but I I'm have... Not, I'm on Google Maps. Should I show them what you got me? He got me a little gift and yeah, my eyelash is definitely falling off of <laughs> I need to go re-glue this. But okay, what, what did we do? We, we It was cold today. It was like 53 degrees, so that's why I'm wearing a pea coat. And showing traffic on the thing. I'm trying to figure out traffic lights. <laughs> And, okay, fine, I'll tell them. So then we walked, he made me walk around. Okay, no, we got here, we went to the north end, went to the Italian restaurant that I showed you, well, I talked about, and then we went, walked around, <laughs> and I was yelling at him the entire time because I was freezing and I wanted to go inside. I think you're blocking the microphone with your finger. Not that. <laughs> and then... And then he, Are you me to say it? I don't know, he made me walk around for like a half hour, I was freezing cold, all I was doing was bitching the entire time. And he brought me over to a fountain, and he asked me an important question. What important <laughs> question was that? He proposed to me. <laughs> you can look at that face. <laughs> that is my fiance. Girls, you better back up, I'll kill you. But that, you look at that face. Oh, that's like. <laughs> but yeah, he proposed to me. Well, tell me about the diamond again. It's a half carat diamond. It's white gold, 14 carat white gold. Uh, there's 68 very, very tiny little diamonds scattered throughout the sides of it. I don't know if they can really see that or not, but all around the bands has all little diamonds. So that's 68 of them. And I spent a lot of money. <laughs> I cried like a little baby. I really did. And then some guy, we were cracking up because like it was it was like a sentimental moment or whatever. And I happened to like look over and this guy is like creeping behind a tree with a professional camera and I'm like, this is a guy you taking but I'm sure he was like he worked for like something or or like a school project or something. I don't know. But anyways <laughs> if I happen to find the photo online I will put it uh, maybe not in this video, but if you follow me on Instagram, my link is in the description. I will put it on there so you can see that if I find it. And I'll let you guys know if I find it, but we are trying to figure out what we want to do. I'm going to eat my ice cream and then a Mavado. nice Mavado. <laughs> and we're going to figure out what to do. So I will talk to you guys in a little bit. Okay, we are officially home. Long day, fun day. Still wearing my ring. I'm so excited for the <laughs> Look at my pictures, but I'm exhausted. We're both very tired and we're both Very ready for bed because we both have a very long ow <laughs> very long day work day ahead of us tomorrow, so <sighs> I'm gonna I'm gonna end this vlog Get in my pajamas and go to bed so thank you guys so much for watching again if you want to follow me on instagram my uh link will be down below also my twitter is on my uh channel you can subscribe if you don't want to miss any new vlogs or videos keep updated with my life <laughs> um and gaming videos when i finally get those coming out and uh yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you tomorrow bye